She wheels her wheelbarrow through streets broad and narrow, the poor unseen ghost of sweet Molly Malone. In Hobart's fair city where things are so pretty, singing cockles and mussels alive, alive, oh. Mussels are not only delicious, but they look good and add to the presentation of most seafood meals, such as boule bays or fisherman's basket, just like they prepare at Muir's Fish House, one of Hobart's many seafood restaurants. I think mussels are particularly good. Firstly, they make the dishes look very good, most attractive. And secondly, they really taste of the sea. When we first opened the restaurant eight years ago, we used to collect mussels, wild mussels, from the jetties and from the rocks around the Derwent estuary. In Tasmania, mussels were a very important part of the Aboriginal diet for thousands of years. And in fact, mussels have been cultivated in Europe for centuries. Yet when George and Jill Muir first suggested the idea of cultivating them in Tasmania, everyone thought they were crazy. Their original idea was to merely provide mussels for their own restaurant. But they and other growers now supply many centres in Tasmania and export markets. The mussel is a bivalve mollusk and feeds on tiny microorganisms which it strains out of seawater passing over its gills. It favours the shallow waters around bays and estuaries where rich nutrients are most plentiful. The Tasmanian coastline with its many bays, coves and inlets is ideal for mussel cultivation. Mussel growing is an extremely efficient industry. Over 50% of its gross weight is edible. The Tasmanian Fisheries Development Authority is actively interested in mussels as a developing industry, which they thoroughly research. In their laboratories, technicians examine mussel specimens to fully understand their growth patterns. Here, a section of mussel is being examined to determine the breeding season. At Muir's Fish House, Mussels Mariniere is very popular. It's a very simple recipe that brings out their flavour. The secret of cooking mussels is that you hardly cook them at all. You let their own juice do all the work. To cook Mussels Mariniere, you first clean the mussels. Quickly boil them, 30 seconds is quite sufficient. The mussels are then opened and the succulent juice is preserved for later. Place some butter in a saucepan and lightly glaze some onions. Then add the mussel juices and some white wine with perhaps a glass for yourself. Bring them to the boil before adding the prepared mussels. As soon as the mussels are heated through, serve them with a garnish to complete the presentation. If you cook them at home or order them at a Tasmanian seafood restaurant, you'll enjoy Mussels Mariniere. <laughs>